Hey there everyone, my name is Sophia. Now today I want to talk to you about tarot. Now, um, if you've listened to me from day one, I kind of called the other tarot readers fluff. <laughs> now, I call them that for a kind of, it's tongue in cheek, but there's a specific reason why I always feel to talk to you about tarot. Because if you're a twin flame, it's absolutely crucial that you have a total understanding about tarot in fact tarot is um in essence created for twin flames specifically this is why it's important so what i'm going to do is tell you why it's so important and why i'm always compelled to tell you about well uh, I say I'm compelled to tell you why I'm always kind of slagging off, which is my character. It, it, that's what I'm like. That's why I'm chosen. So I have to be in your face so that you understand how unique and special you are so that you distinguish correctly the proper people to associate with because you are teachers for planet Earth. We're not talking about in schools. We're talking about different level of teaching. So I want to explain to you tarot. Now, like I just stated, tarot is specifically designed, quote unquote designed, but it's created for twin flames. Why I state that is because tarot is based around love. The highest frequency on this planet and this planet is created for love the highest frequency of love is with a twin flame there is no higher frequency i repeat of love than when you are in the exact alignment higher frequency match of your twin flame other words when you two are um in a happy mode so that's why tarot is designed for love soulmates get tarot because twin flames are not as um, out there and um, they're quite unique and rare so and twin flames is now kind of being heard about as a fashion label really let's state that's still a kind of fashion label so what happens is tarot readers generally just um, do love readings for soulmates now let me explain a bit deeper why i state yet again the tarot is for you if you have a tarot reader that you go to that just has learnt the fool's journey then let, get the hell off them because they're not for you why because anybody can Buy a pack of cards, tarot cards. I don't know the names because I'm not about knowing the names. I'm about intuition, which what you should be about because you're a twin flame. But there's basic tarot cards which tell you specifically, which you lot know, you know, the one of swords, the two of, you know, wands. And, you know, that means this, this means that. And you put it all together and then you can do the story. So they just shuffle, it comes out and they kind of make together a story. That's not an intuition tarot reader. Now, so if you're going to go to a tarot reader, you need to go to someone who's channeling, well, yeah, channeling to use their intuition, not just reading the story. The, the story from what the the book tells them what to do this is absolutely important now i'm going to state some names there's people like tyler's tarot that pull a lot of people because of their very blatant kind of like me T tyler tarot is but the thing is which you need to avoid as well and i'm making it clear you need to avoid because you are a teacher if you are watching things and doing things but you're a teacher that you shouldn't be doing you're not going to ever get there tylo's tarot or anybody that states after they flip a card from their intuition whatever i can't pronounce that <laughs> why say channel it i'll say it's channeled intuition right and then they say 
well, I've told you not to do this, or in my opinion, or don't accept this, or what, you, if they ever say anything like that, get the hell off their channel. Why? Because tarot is specifically only for intuition. And why I say it's targeted for twin flames is because twin flames are here on planet Earth to tell everyone that you live from your intuition. This planet has been manipulated from entities and um, humans that are manipulating other humans to believe that they are nothing. I state constantly, you do not understand how unique you are. Most human beings, soulmates, are quote unquote normals, let's call them. Don't get into the, the labels, right? People not like twin flames, let's say, are unique and special. And if I, they, oh, the veil of illusion from the third dimension perceives humanity to be what they're not, see us as less than. That's third dimension. Twin flames are from 4D upwards, which is you use your intuition. So you are here to teach all humanity that you live from 4D upwards, then you won't be enslaved in the mental enslavement of following secret societies and entities that enslave you to believe that you are less than. You are training them to be what you are supposed to be. So if you then go on to a tarot reader and they say, here's the uh, two of wands, you should know what to do. This is what I would do. If he's over there cheating, I would suggest you can do, even if they think they're saying for the best of your good, I would suggest you go and get someone better or, you know, you can do better than that or blah, blah, blah soon as they put their opinion, that is an incorrect tarot reader because the entire reason of tarot is for intuition. Intuition is important because every human has that. It's their in, intuition, internal guidance system. So therefore, a tarot reader, if they into, use their intuition, I'm not going to say that word, and tell you what's happening in the car, they are tapping into your frequency, because 4D is everybody's frequency, 3D is manipulation, so what they're doing is, they are, what's the word, intertwining 3D with 4D within their tarot reading, for example, they're using intuition through the cards, and then they're giving their own belief system, from third dimension of what they perceive what you should do within the tower reading and think that they know best. You are supposed to come away from that. You are purely here to teach others you follow your bliss. Your bliss is your intuition. That is the compass of your life. That is 4D upwards. Now I'm going to tell you about the, the actual tarot in itself, which many don't even know. There are people like Eat, Reap, Pray, Sal, I think his name is. Now, I like him because I can, I'm an empath, just as you are, and I can read people, but I have kind of, um, I'm um, a visual clairvoyant, which means I can, when I see people, you know, particularly when I'm watching videos, I can feel them even better. Sal is pretty much a genuine person. And he is pretty much using his intuition. But still yet again, he is in and out between twin flame, soulmate, whatevers. You need to target specifically for your situation. There's soulful revolution. Now, she's pretty good. She uses her intuition. But I think I heard a video that she's a twin flame. So here's my issue with people. Yeah, it's my issue, so I don't care what they say <laughs> about me. My issue with people and why I am here, why I am different, and it sounds vain, I don't give a shit. There are people that state they are twin flames, and but they are in union. That is no good for the selected amount of twin flames 
like you lot that are not in union. They cannot advise you what to do to get to union because generally they always say, I was in the drama. Drama, 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 six, eight years later, then we're married. And then they come onto YouTube and say, we're in union. We went through your drama. Don't do that. Why am I different? I am the only one who is now going through the journey, not living with someone, not married to someone. So you can relate to me that I am going through what you need to do. You have never heard me say my person has gone ghost for months. We're arguing. The drama's here. So you can look at me and hear. I always say, I saw him yesterday. I saw him last week. There's not a week go past that I haven't heard from him or seen him. I generally, not text. I don't do phone thing. Email him I, uh, this morning. Why is that important? You need to follow people that you are or what you want to be like so that you can show people. If you are listening to someone who's a tarot reader, oh, I'm a twin flame, but never talks about their twin flame, how do you know their twin flame ain't ghost and they're just doing what most do that are ignoring them and not having empathy and understanding their situation? There is far, 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 far more to know about the twin flame dynamic. My next video is going to be about your person. It's absolutely vital that you know about your person. I don't care if they're cheating, they're alcoholics or whatever. You should not have more than a week or two without communication with your person. If not, it's you. It's absolutely you. And it doesn't matter if you're at the frequency of me. Even if we're good, I still have to learn how to focus in and understand this twin flame dynamic. So my next video is going to be about your person, but I'm going to go back to tarot. So I was saying about soulful revolution, talks about twin flames, which she still bundles it in the same situation. And she even said once in a video about you can become a twin flame. I don't know where she's going with that. You need to target people that are, it's absolutely vital you get the right person to listen to. I've been on, before I used to say to people, send me channels and I will see if they're good. When they come up and they're talking, hi, and they've got all this fairy dust and they're blessed loved ones and they're all like, you know, the reason why I am here is because I am like most. And the reason why Twin Flames and people are not in union is because they look at these people on YouTube that are all pretending to be angelic and angel-like, and they are not. I am a Twin Flame, but I'm not sitting here fluff so you can relate to me and be like me. That's why I state your names in my videos. So you don't think of me as, as if I am just the main center focus. If you look up to me, you won't be like me. Fact. If you look at a tarot reader and they're saying, I'm in union and this is what we've done. And they don't speak about anyone else. They don't look, they don't show any emotions. They're all loved up. It's not real. It's not real. You need to come away from that because you lot, who I am targeting, are the new generations to show the next generation of Twin Flames how to start it correctly. You are fucking important. You need to understand the Twin Flame journey. Come away from shitty tarot. If they've got titles and fluffiness and high -end angelic souls who the fuck talks like that you need to show everyone i repeat everyone how to live from internally and most people talk like me not like the tarot readers that you are following you are the new leaders of what they need to be like let me explain this you tell me one person you know that explains tarot 
the most important card in the tarot what do you think it is now you might think it's the ten of cups because that's union which they don't even say they say it's an emotional new start or some say it's the ending ten of cups is the union you might think it's the fool's journey which is close i'll tell you what the most important card in the fool's journey is it's the three of cups yes the three of cups represent the entirety of a twin flame. Why? Because it's the yin and yang of exactly what you are. What do I mean about that? What does the three of cups represent? It represents two things and they're the complete opposites, which is up above, so below, black and white, yin and yang, you and your person, which is third party and celebration within one card that is what you have to master the third party which you're nagging and bitching your person about should turn into a celebration which is the dynamic of a twin flame they don't even know that the sword represents your person because they are the mental thinker within the within the twin flame dynamic which is the um, masculine the cups represents you because you're the leader, which you're the emotional person, which you have to sort out your emotions. The pentacles are important because I keep telling you, this planet is manipulated. The highest frequency is through money, the form of money. That's why I keep saying you need to get your money right and pay for fucking reading. You need to prioritize your money. The twin flame journey is tarot, absolutely. The fools, the zero, the new beginning. If you visualize the card as I'm talking about it, he's leaping into the unknown. You do not fucking need to know about what's going on with your person. That's the fool's journey. The unknown, leap into the unknown. Take the risk. Stop looking third dimensional. The tarot is about you. You're going to listen to someone else who's pretending to be someone on television, which you're not supposed to be fucking watching. Who talks about the stuff I talk about? No one, because they don't know. I'm from 5D. 5D is where twin flames are created, contracted where they are assigned to come down. That's why I know so much about this stuff. It is what you need to know. You need to focus on how important you are and stop focusing on your person. It's about you. I need to, I got so much, I keep thinking, I don't know how I'm going to get everything out there. It's so deep and unique and special this twin flame journey because you are teaching people how special they are which you are the same as them but you're just going to bring it out of them but you can't do that unless you come away from stupid people like tyler's tarot that's totally insecure he doesn't even offer readings. Why? Because he's so scared of getting cussed out because he doesn't know what he's talking about. He can raw all he like on YouTube, but you know, if you met him in person, he'll, he'll weep. He's soft. He's insecure. So I haven't really even got anything bad to say about him. Apart from what the hell is a twin flame listening to him for? A twin flame, that bond you have, that Paul is just love. It's fuck all to do with cheating. It's fuck all to do with addictions. It's just love. That's all that is. So what you bothered about any of that for? It's very, very, very important that you come away from certain things and focus on what this is about for you. Now, I'm not going to go too much into this. I've said enough. There's enough there you should know about tarot anyway. I want to end this by talking about your person. And the next video, shit, I've got so much to do. It might be about your person, actually. Because you need to know about that. Because you lot keep... You're still cussing off your person. I can't understand it. Without them, you wouldn't be so fucking special. 
I don't know how else to say it. I appreciate my person because without him, I wouldn't be a fucking twin flame. That's what I want you to focus on. I want you, if you watch tarot, here's a, here's a tip if you know if they're good or not. Titles is important. Titles is how they pull in the people. I said I know about marketing. It's very important. If you go to them and you look at the title, that's what you do, because that's what, that's what marketing is, then you click on the video. That's why I always have Twin Flame Tower Reader. I'm not bothered about the fucking title. I see if you go in, if you're bothered, if you're pulled to me and you listen and it resonates, even if it doesn't, but you can hear from the other videos that it resonates, you stick with me, that's what you're supposed to do. If you go on them and they've got some flash-ass title, I want you to go down to at least two or three months and see if they're repeating the same fucking title, just a different version. For example, he's going to tell you he loves you. Then you go to two weeks previous, he's got something to say. Then two weeks before that, he wants to uh, confess. Then two weeks before, it's always something to pull you in to look at the fucking reading. These days, they don't even bother. They just put in titles and it's absolutely nothing to do with the actual, what they're um, on the cards, what they're saying in the cards. If it's something like that, it shouldn't be, don't need fucking titles. Do you know how long it takes to figure out what to put in the title? When you can just put twin flame reading. <laughs> Do you see what I mean? It's all manipulation. The soulful revolution. She's a good tarot reader. But I tell you what I dislike about her. Because I've done marketing. If you listen to me. I've done it for 15 years. I can see how she pulls you in. <laughs> with her marketing skills. And she even says she works in television. That's a fucking worse man. That's an Illuminati uh, hub she worked in. So she knows the tricks of the train, trade and she says she was a presenter. She knows exactly what to say to manipulate you to get a bloody extended reading. I don't care how, 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 how she seems to be. Feel people. Feel her. Every, I, like I said, Sal... Sal is very television, but he's truthful. Soulful revolution, fake. What's the difference? They're both Sagittarius, and I'm Sagittarius, because she's always putting on a fake. Sal sometimes gets pissed off. Sometimes he changes his character. He slips up and says, I've got a script. You know, she pretends she's like that all the time. Differences, and you lot should know this. You lot are empaths, light workers. You lot are here to show people this is what we're like. We're not angelic. We swear. We're, we're normal. They're pretending to be what the, you're not supposed to be. You're not here to follow them. You're supposed to be like me. Stop listening to them. That's what you have to do. If you're a tarot reader, I've got to do about mission. There's so much I've got to talk to you lot about you don't even know. If you're a tarot reader, if you lot follow me, I had Walter. Actually, Ruba left an email saying that who's Loren, can't find Loren's channel, which is my twin sister, and who's Walter. So if you went in my playlist and you saw, um, you heard about them. Walter, when I was here oh, about a month, Walter was just a person who left a comment and he said he was doing tarot reading courses with soulful revolution now listen to this i said to him in the in the comments what the arse are you to go into anyone to tell you how to use your own intuition tarot is your own intuition you don't need a fucking lesson you chuck the cards and you tap into your ownness so he stopped and I said, I'll tell you what, I've only been on here for a month. I'll direct everyone on here to you. That's Walter. Now he's gone. I don't know where he is. I don't know if he's still out there. So that's what happened with Walter. So if you want to do tarot, you just do the same. You get on YouTube and you use your own intuition. 
just like how I did. My twin sister, where's she gone? I don't know. She's in and out everywhere, left, right. So she's not up on here, but Walter might be around. I can't pronounce his channel. I never could, but um, I, I removed them both. They were both in the links, but my sister don't do it. She never has. And um, I, like I said, I don't know what he's doing. So this is about, this is my little rant on tarot. And I've been holding it back because I'm thinking, oh, well, I shouldn't really say anything, but I was compelled to say it today because of I thought, no, let you know that that's what tarot's cre it's created for us lot. We are the highest frequency, and that's love, let alone sex, which another video's got to do. Oh, I forgot to mention the wands. The wands in the tarot is the actual sex frequency. The entire tarot is about the twin flame. Wands, the sex in soulmate, is nowhere the same as in a, a twin flame dynamic. That's why on my relationship website, I it is targeted for men and I talk about sex on it as well. Because soulmate sex is completely different compared to twin flame. Wands, swords cups <laughs> pentacles all is relation to the twin flame dynamic so go into those tarots that you're listening to you scroll down and you see how many of them that say the same fucking title that pull you in unless they've got twin flame tower reader that's it unless they're a twin flame they say they're a twin flame they need to be a twin flame they need to be a twin flame that's using their intuition not just reading the story that's another thing they need to be talking about their person what the fuck are they doing not talking about their person how the hell do you know they're a twin flame if they're not talking about their person they're not with their person then they're nowhere mastering the twin flame journey like i am that's why i talk about my person but i don't talk too much about him because it's his free will to want to be if he wants to come up and talk about himself but i heard from him today in an email hopefully i see him for valentine's who knows i don't care every day is valentine's with him that's how you lot got to be i'm out i've got a reading with sharon later who actually i'll just mention in case she's listening is a light worker so um yep Okay, um, I'm going to get some elements out and uh, thanks for listening.